Boeing has been under fire again after safety concerns and delays shook public trust. Just when the aviation giant thought it could hold its ground, Elon Musk dropped a bombshell. I've got an entire design for an electric supersonic vertical takeoff jet. This marks the introduction of Tesla's super electric plane, a development that could trigger the end of Boeing's traditional dominance. Musk even admitted, but since it's a totally new product with totally new, you know, like everything is totally new, I'll say we're succeeding if we get to half of the 10, you know, half the 10,000. That level of ambition alone is enough to shake the aviation world. In this story, we'll explore Tesla's latest breakthroughs, how the plane pushes range limits, clears some of the strictest FAA regulations, and redefines the future of flight. Tesla's compact wing design achieves an unbelievable 1,500-mile range. Short wings typically mean limited distance, but Tesla's plane defies expectations, zipping 1,500 miles while leaving Boeing's long-span designs in the dust. The secret lies in cracking the Breguet range equation, the holy grail of aviation efficiency. Traditionally, range is defined by velocity, fuel consumption, lift-to-drag ratio, and weight reduction during fuel burn. Boeing's jets shed tens of thousands of pounds of fuel in flight, but Tesla's electric design maintains nearly constant weight, keeping the logarithmic term favorable. Their specific energy consumption drops to just 0.15 to 0.2 pounds equivalent per pound per hour, thanks to 95% motor efficiency versus the 40% typical in jets. Tesla targets a lift-to-drag ratio of 25 to 1, a 47% improvement over conventional 17 to 1 jets. Distributed propulsion with multiple motors along the wing generates the blown wing effect, boosting lift by 50% and cutting drag by 25%. Carbon fiber composites cut wing weight nearly in half while maintaining strength, and variable geometry allows the wings to adapt mid-flight, reducing drag by 38%. Combined, these innovations let Tesla's compact design perform like wings twice their size, enabling 1,500 miles of range on less energy than a Boeing 737 burns in 500 miles. Yet range is only part of the story. The FAA has historically demanded strict adherence to pilot requirements, mandating at least 1,500 training hours under Part 135 rules. These standards exist because when aviation fails, Consequences are catastrophic, as seen with the 737 MAX crisis. Tesla, however, sidesteps this barrier with an innovative approach. Early flights fall under Part 91 experimental rules, allowing data collection without full commercial restrictions. This coincides with regulatory shifts that favor electrified vertical takeoff aircraft, as seen with Joby Aviation's 2025 certification path. Tesla leverages its 10 billion miles of autopilot testing, where AI demonstrates error rates of just 1 in a billion operations compared to human pilots 1 in 100,000. AI handles primary flight operations while remote human pilots oversee flights via Starlink with latency under 100 milliseconds, satisfying the FAA's requirement for pilot oversight without physical presence. Redundant AI systems, backup batteries, and fault-tolerant design push projected crash risks to 1 in 10 billion flight hours, safer than driving to the airport. Tesla's AI pilot transforms safety in life-or-death situations. Human pilots, while skilled, suffer from fatigue and reaction delays. Studies show fatigue accounts for up to 20% of incidents, with average human reaction times of 1 to 2 seconds. Tesla's AI, trained on billions of real and simulated miles, responds in milliseconds, analyzing thousands of data points every second. In engine failure scenarios, redundant neural networks calculate glide paths to landable terrain instantly, while remote human pilots can intervene if necessary. This layered system prevents single points of failure and uses predictive algorithms to anticipate turbulence, mechanical faults, and weather threats before they escalate. Transparency builds trust every AI decision is logged in real time, unlike traditional black boxes that only explain disasters after the fact. This creates a system not just safer than human pilots, but also auditable and understandable to regulators and passengers alike. Beyond safety, Tesla's electric plane promises practical solutions for short-haul travelers. 
A flexible 4-12-seat cabin ensures fast boarding and modular conversions between passenger, cargo, and emergency medical service roles. Turnarounds shrink to just 15 minutes thanks to modular battery swaps, quick-release seating, and standardized line-replaceable units. Quiet electric motors unlock early morning and late evening airport slots, boosting schedule reliability. Distributed propulsion cuts noise to mid-70s decibels during cruise, far below traditional turboprops. Maintenance is simplified through modular components, with two-person teams able to swap faulty systems in minutes. Operating costs plummet as electricity replaces costly jet fuel, pushing per-flight hour energy costs down to $25 to $50 versus $225 to $315 for comparable turboprops. For airlines, this means higher utilization and lower costs. A single Tesla aircraft could credibly operate 10 to 16 short legs daily, compared to 6 to 8 for conventional types. With tickets priced between $79 and $139, Tesla's model transforms regional economics by turning short-haul routes profitable again. Community airports, thousands of which remain underused across the United States, become viable gateways, compressing door-to-door -door travel times that once took four to nine hours by car into just one to four hours by air. The deeper innovation lies in Tesla's modular energy system. Instead of waiting 45 minutes to charge, crews swap preconditioned packs in 5 to 10 minutes. Thermal management keeps cells between 20 to 35 degrees Celsius, maximizing cycle life to over 1,500 uses. Redundant high-voltage buses, smart contactors, and independent avionics batteries turn electrical faults into minor performance reductions rather than emergencies. Avionics feature automatic landing, energy-aware routing, and live range rings that account for weather and reserves in real time. Structurally, Tesla blends aerospace-grade carbon fiber with aluminum-lithium alloys for lightweight strength. Carbon fiber is eight times stronger than aluminum at a fraction of the weight, while aluminum-lithium alloys reduce density by up to 10% and improve stiffness by 20%. These materials extend lifespan, resist corrosion, and absorb impacts better than traditional designs, all while reducing maintenance costs. Tesla's rumored use of aluminum-ion batteries could further revolutionize aviation, offering 10 plus cycles, non-flammable electrolytes, and abundant raw material supply chains. The result is not simply another aircraft, but a disruptive platform, a supersonic capable, vertical takeoff electric jet priced at $79,935 per unit. It's a machine that could slash CO2 emissions by hundreds of millions of tons, restore affordable regional travel, and reshape aviation the way the iPhone reshaped communication. The only question left is whether Boeing can survive this storm, or if Tesla has already triggered the dawn of a new aviation era. The future of urban mobility has already arrived. Chinese automaker GAC has unveiled a revolutionary flying car called Gove. It is a hybrid between a ground vehicle and an aircraft, with vertical takeoff and landing capabilities. The design of Gove allows the vehicle to be separated into two parts, a flight cabin and a chassis. In ground mode, Gove functions like a regular car, but when needed, the cabin can detach and take off into the air using 12 propellers mounted on six axes. The chassis remains on the ground and not only supports the cabin but also serves as a mobile charging station. After the cabin detaches, the chassis automatically moves to the nearest charging station to replenish its energy. When the cabin returns, the communication system ensures precise automatic docking and safe landing. This enhances the efficiency of Gove and reduces the time required for the next flight. In recent months, Tesla has faced serious challenges. A sharp decline in sales, supply chain issues, and growing competition have forced the company to seek new avenues for development. However, according to insider information, Tesla has decided to respond to these challenges with an unconventional and ambitious move. Recently, close sources revealed that the company held a secret presentation for a select group of individuals. Elon Musk himself was present at the event, and the biggest sensation of the showcase was a new lineup of vehicles set to revolutionize the industry. Among the prototypes presented, 
Particular attention was drawn to Tesla's first ever flying car, as well as the company's first airplane. According to insiders, Tesla's leadership was pleased with the results of the presentation and has already given the green light for further development of these projects. An official announcement is expected soon, where the company will share more details about these groundbreaking products. Sony, a company known for its cutting edge technologies in electronics, robotics, and gaming consoles, has also decided to enter the flying transport market. According to insider information, the corporation has already begun working on the concept of a flying car of the future. At the moment, there are no official details regarding the design or specifications of the vehicle. However, enthusiasts and independent designers are already imagining what a future Sony car might look like. In their vision, it is a sleek aerodynamic vehicle equipped with advanced sensor technology, artificial intelligence integration, and possibly even augmented reality elements in the cockpit. Would you be interested in a flying car design from the well-known company Sony? Let us know in the comments. China continues to maintain its leadership in the development of flying cars, and the Xpeng land aircraft carrier by Sung-8 is no exception. This modular flying vehicle was unveiled at CES 2025 and has already received more than 3,000 pre-orders, with deliveries scheduled to begin in 2026. The land aircraft carrier consists of ground and aerial modules. The ground module, known as the mothership, is a three-axle vehicle with six wheels featuring a six-by-six all-wheel drive system and rear-wheel steering. It is designed to fit easily into standard parking spaces and underground garages. The aerial module is equipped with six rotors with dual ducts, foldable arms, and blades. Its carbon structure ensures both strength and lightness, while the panoramic cabin with a 270 degrees view provides an expansive field of vision during flight. Users can choose between manual and autonomous flight modes. Perhaps one of the most advanced and futuristic flying vehicles is Voler, by the British company Bellwether Industries. This electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft represents the concept of a flying hypercar designed for private owners. The cabin is designed for two passengers seated in tandem, emphasizing its sporty character. All elements of the electric propulsion system, including duct fans, are concealed beneath a streamlined body, giving the aircraft an elegant and seamless appearance. This prototype was unveiled at the Dubai Air Show and demonstrated stable flight at a speed of up to 40 km per hour. The company plans for the production version of Voler to reach speeds of up to 220 km per hour and offer a flight duration of 60 to 90 minutes. The expected width of the aircraft is approximately 3.2 meters, making it compact and convenient for urban use. While the largest Chinese and American companies are developing flying transportation, independent engineers and enthusiasts from around the world are also joining the race for the skies. Thanks to accessible technologies, three-dimensional printing, powerful batteries, and advanced software solutions, they are creating projects that sometimes rival the developments of technological giants. In garages, small workshops, and startup laboratories, unique flying machine concepts are emerging ranging from single-passenger air taxis to personal drones for rapid transportation. Some of these designs stand out for their efficiency and innovation, introducing new engine configurations, lightweight composite materials, and advanced control systems. Unlike large corporations, enthusiasts are not bound by corporate constraints and often move faster, experimenting with radical ideas and bold solutions. Their work proves that the future of aerial transportation is not only being shaped in the laboratories of major companies but also in the minds of talented engineers across the globe. Russian engineers are striving to keep up with their Chinese counterparts. Recently, the company Transport of the Future introduced its new unmanned air taxi named S700, which is expected to replace ground taxis in the near future. This aircraft combines advanced technologies and is designed to enhance urban mobility, allowing passengers to travel through the air while avoiding traffic congestion and crowded streets. The S700 is built using a multi-copter design and is equipped with 16 propeller motor groups, ensuring high stability, maneuverability, and safety during flight. The aircraft is designed to carry two passengers and can ascend to an altitude of up to 3,500 meters, 
although its optimal operating height is around 300 meters. The maximum speed of the air taxi reaches 100 km per hour with a flight range of up to 30 km. A single battery charge provides between 15 and 25 minutes of autonomous flight. Recently, footage of tests for Lockheed Martin's latest hypersonic reconnaissance and strike aircraft, named State Route 72, has spread across the Internet. The aircraft is being developed under Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works secret program. Known as the Son of Blackbird, the State Route 72 is a next-generation hypersonic unmanned aerial vehicle designed as a successor to the legendary State Route 71 Blackbird reconnaissance aircraft. The State Route 72 is expected to reach hypersonic speeds exceeding Mach 5, more than 6,000 km per hour, which is twice as fast as the maximum speed of its predecessor. Its primary role is intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance. Due to its high speed, the aircraft can penetrate areas with advanced air defense systems while remaining beyond the reach of modern anti-aircraft weaponry. Unlike its predecessor, the State Route 72 will also have strike capabilities, including the ability to carry hypersonic missiles, allowing it to perform both reconnaissance and combat tasks. The first demonstration flight of the State Route 72 is expected to take place in 2025, with operational deployment plan for the 2030s. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Core Tech Channel. Also, check out our previous videos. See you next time.